Well, how do that, Charms to Zai, Captain of the Steves, and today, Charms, for you guys in the Viewerverse, I'm back inside of No Man's Sky, and I'm inside of the Echoes update. Now, a lot of people out there have said to me that they can't get the mission to trigger, you know, for the whole new Echoes content to get their staff. I've already done two videos on it. You saw that I managed to trigger it by sheer freaking accident on my normal save. Now, this is my creative save that I'm in right now. Now, Z Zane's World has put out a video about these prerequisites that are needed. Not that they were well known to everybody out there in the verse. I mean, inside the patch notes, it says go and speak to Nada. That does not trigger the mission either, people in the view of us. Heck no, it doesn't. No, no, no. So what are the prerequisites? Well, there's three prerequisites, people. Now, the main one being is you need to have completed the purge. OK, so the purge is one of the main ones, and that's like end game sort of content. It takes you through all of, the, all of the Artemis quest line to the end game. I mean, that's got its own prerequisites. In fact, I've put everything up on the screen for you. I have, you know, the image right there. So you can see exactly what you need to complete the purge. OK, so that's quite a big one. Another is the traces of metal. Again, I'm going to put everything on the screen over there and go and hit that up and take a quick read of that. But the traces of metal, that one was introduced not so long ago. And yes, you build your own shell and you get your own Laylapse droid. If you haven't got your own Laylapse droid, then you haven't done the Traces of Metal. Now, if you go inside of your log, you can see here, I haven't done the Traces of Metal on my creative saves. So I can't do it on this creative save either. It's worth checking your list of missions to make sure that you haven't got anything that's outstanding that's already underway. Even after you've completed these prerequisites, maybe select a mission where, you know, it takes you off of the main missions, you know. And the last one is the harmonic camp. So you need to locate a harmonic camp. It was introduced during fractals. Again, I'm going to put all the information over there that you need on harmonic camps. So they're the pre free requisites that you need before you're going to get to trigger the mission. After you've managed to complete all of those prerequisites and their own prerequisites, <laughs> which is all nested, it's end game content at the end of the day, people. So if you're a new player just jumping in, hoping to do all this new fangly dangly stuff, you have to have at least completed the purge, the traces of metal and found a harmonic camp before it triggers. And then it will trigger automatically just by jumping systems in space. Once all those prerequisites have been met, people in the view of us. So that's everything I've got for you. I will put a link up there to Zane's World's video because Dark Lord Zeric jumped into the game files and found these prerequisites in there. I'm still trying to find out what the prerequisites are for spawning a Sentinel Dreadnought because I've only done one battle and now I can't do another one to get the blinking frigate. So I'm still learning, people. I'm still learning. Until next time, goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again.